Alright, no better, The Myth of the Human Augmentation, Volume 1, by William Taggart. Humankind has always sought to improve itself from the earliest iterations of civilization. We improved our minds through education and the pursuit of knowledge, our souls through the quest for spiritual truth, and our bodies through the eradication of disease and hunger. You'll forgive me, perhaps, when I dare to say that the human being is a divine engine. It is the ultimate expression of life on our earth, and so it is a most precious and sacred thing. Humanity is what we have. It is what we are. But that purity falls beneath a shadow, and that shadow is greed. It is weakness. The power is at our fingertips to replace flesh with steel and plastic. But the truth is, for each piece of yourself you surrender, your humanity dies a little more. You are no better. I don't know if I agree with that, because even as a vampire, you can have humanity. So, in a way, I, I feel a little bit different about uh, what he's saying there. I mean, I can understand that replacing yourself seems kind of strange, but at the same time, I mean, hey, we've already got, like, replacements for plenty of things in today's uh, day and age. <laughs> and I mean, we've even got lap bands and crap. We've got pacemakers, we've got false teeth, we've got uh, prosthetic limbs, all that kind of stuff. I don't know that you really lose humanity unless you, uh, unless you literally change your brain out. Because your brain is pretty much where your humanity is coming from as far as I'm concerned. No, uh, no squishy stuff like the hearts. Of course, the, uh, the brain is technically squishy, but that's, that's not the point I'm making here. The point is that your humanity is not going to be lost just because you replaced your heart with, uh, some metal thing that beats a little faster. At least that's my opinion. Maybe not other people's opinions. Huh. I wonder if I could make this jump. Hmm... I kind of feel like I'm going to die if I do that, and I've done a lot of things, so I'm going to go ahead and save, just to make sure that uh, I don't screw myself over. Okay. <laughs> I definitely did not make it, but I didn't die either. Looks like my health is refilling just fine. Um, I'm dead now. <laughs> I did not mean to fall that far off. Okay. Well, I kind of saw that coming, so, um... Whatever. Where did the music go? It's all of a sudden really dead silent. I guess that... Okay, there it goes. Just randomly came back. Alright, well, I definitely need to get an augmentation for my legs so I can jump higher. Otherwise, I'm not going to be able to make jumps like that. I would like to search over there, but that's not going to happen with my current limb capacity. I'll work on it later. What we got going on in here? Anything at all? Did I did I miss any doors? Just want to make sure I didn't. No, doesn't look like it. Okay. Well, we got something to hack here. Security rating two. We shall hack it, or try anyway. Let's go for it. All right. Um. Holy crap! This is insane. Okay, so this thing can come straight across. Um, wow. Let's go for it. Oh boy. Oh boy, I'm caught. Access denied. There was no way. 
<laughs> I am way too slow for that one. I think I will wait on that. Actually, I wonder something. I'm curious, does the... Do the attempts, um... Get regenerated, or does it uh, does it stay out? I don't know. I don't think they do. So I think it boots you out, and then you you come back, and then it's just kind of screwed. Okay, a couple seconds to check this out. No, it says four. Okay, I guess it does. If you disconnect from this thing does regenerate all of your attempts. That's cool. I can't open this one. At some point, I'm definitely going to need to get more hacking capabilities. I think hacking is probably what I'm going to be doing a lot of focus on. Wow, is there, like, no way down from here? Not safely, anyhow. Unless I can go into one of these windows, which doesn't look like it. I suppose if I had limb enhancements, I could uh, jump up from here and go somewhere. But I do not, so I believe I would be dead here. This would be a great sniping position, though. Is this the... Uh... No, that that's probably the the other side over there. Well, I'm not sure. Anyway, let's check out something. Six. I want to see how this thing works. Yeah, this thing is awesome. It's like a sniper rifle, except with tranks. That is just sweet. I don't know where he even puts that thing. I guess maybe he's got, like, um, an augmented pouch somewhere in his body. Because you do have the bil the ability to uh, augment yourself and uh, gain some extra space. So, you know what? Since this doesn't really hurt me, I think I might try this one more time. Just for the heck of it. Alright, we're going to go ahead and hit up here first. And we'll hit up here second. Could really use some spam. Come on. Stop. Thank you. Come on. Stop. Access granted. Mine. Nice. What do we got in here? I really need to find a place that sells those uh, hacking devices. That would be really nice. I don't know if there's even a place that would sell hacking devices. Is there anything back here? Does not look like it. What is this? Oh, a credit chip. 43 credits. Not making my stay in this place very worthwhile so far. Especially after wasting a couple of uh, hacking items. Whoops. Did not mean to do that television, some booze. Uh, ooh, here we go. Ebook. I'm actually going to uh, to read this elsewhere. Computer. Let's see here. Hello. That is nice. Oh, a newspaper too. Anything here? Come on. That doesn't look like it. Damn, that thing went bye bye I guess that's because I've been getting stronger. Anyway, let's uh, let's check out the new ebook that we just got called On View. Wednesday nights essential viewing on hollow flat screen and streaming media. Great, it's the TV guide. 8 p.m. to 10 p.m. Uh, Picus News Network, the Global Report with Eliza Kassan. Uh, cast in interviews, Cyber Olympian Sandra Pappenhaus, I guess, um, and and Elder Rocker Joko. Channel 120, Heroes on Call, episode 212. Whatever happened to Heroes? That show was kind of cool. 
I wish that would come back on. Anyways, uh, the conclusion of this two-part episode finds Todd and his Bell Tower team trapped in the orphanage by Ewan Hit Squad. Didn't we read about Bell Tower earlier? I don't know. And that totally sounds like 24 right there. Anyways, uh, DigiDirect, Clean Sheets, hapless detective Jack Clean forces his partner to masquerade as his wife when Susan divorces him with hilarious results. So now we've got kind of like friends, except now kind of like a Jack Bauer reference maybe. So they're kind of like mixing up the shows is what it looks like. I don't know if that's just me or... Or what? Anyways, uh, Pike is Sports 3, National Enhanced Hockey League coverage of the Paris Towers versus Seattle Hammers game. Uh, World Watch 1 HD. Holly, Wood, and Vine. Holly discovers she is pregnant. Wow. Okay. So uh, I can figure out what the Vine and the Wood are. Can you? <laughs> um, anyways, Envision. Envision Extra, the Panacea Projects, uh, Cinevid, Swords of Soulban, Fantasy Adventure, 2014, rated PG, M3V, uh, Nyasha Kim, the Steel Skin Tour, live concerts from Mombasa. I don't know if I would want to call it the Steel Skin Tour after I got an accident to get the Steel Skin. Whatever. Uh, Pike is Sports 5, Augmented Combat Challenge 2026 World Championship, highlights of last year's championship. Okay, so it definitely seems like it's 2027 based on that. Check out this newspaper. Uh, we have seen this already. Alright, and we have one last thing, which is the computer, because I think this is what we got. Yep, that's the on view thing. Wow, it's actually four pages. It felt a lot smaller when I was reading it out of my uh, augmented abilities in my brain. Ooh, heckable. Uh, this shouldn't be too hard. Um, let's see here. Ooh, some stuff. Let's see here. I would like this. Whoa, already? Dang. Um. I don't think I'm going to be able to... Yeah, I'm not going to make it. Denied. <laughs> There's no way that I can make it to that other thing. Because um, that thing is really quick. Yeah. I don't think I'll be coming back here, though. So I kind of want to just get this over with, with this computer. I'm surprised with the security rating of 1, it detected me so easily. Alright, come on. Three, two, one, and go. Yeah, I highly doubt I'm ever going to be back here. Wait a minute. Hold on, hold on. What was the... R. Marley? Hmm. R. Marley. Nope, I don't know the name. Not at the top of my head, anyway. I was just curious if it was... something... All right, anyway. Huh. Interesting. Didn't get caught there. Okay, did get caught there. Quickly, go, 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 go. Access granted. Works for me. Finally hooked up. Hey, B, so you finally moved in, huh? They broke any of your stuff? Just let me know when they hook up your internets. I'll come and give you a hand with everything. Take care of your big brother. All right, then. That was a very useless email, but I better make sure to go in here and get the little new thing off, or I'll be like, did I read this already? I don't know. <clears throat> that would be bad. All right, there's, I guess, nothing. What the hell? Every time I try to throw this box, my just my weapon comes out. I guess it's because this stuff is too close, and it uh, causes me to drop the box. Anyway, whatever. Let's see, is there anything else in here? Besides a bunch of fragile boxes. I'm unpacking for you. Don't worry. I'm helpful. Lol, lol, lol. Okay. <clears throat> 
I have unpacked your fridge. Don't worry. I am the newest mover in town. Everything's good here. My job is done. Are these your boxes? I must help you unpack. Ah, that's good enough. This person has a lot of boxes around here, though. Alright, is there anything else in here? That's just that again. Well, hacking kind of seems simple if uh, your tries don't run out. You can basically just disengage it and come back later. Oh, so this is um, from down there. Interesting. And that is that place. I don't know that I will be able to make it over there or that I will remember that I need to make it over there at some point. Someone remind me when I have the ability to jump! Unless I figure it out myself, I don't know. See, the, the main thing that's really good about this... Whoops. I, I think I freaked people out. Um, wow. What the hell? <laughs> I was just throwing a dumpster. Come on. Well, interestingly enough, it kind of auto-saved right here. Um, and I kind of noticed something, that uh, if you get to certain locations... Well, it didn't do it that time, but if you get to certain locations, it looks like there's a random disk that appears on the top of the screen, and I believe that might be the checkpoint icon. I just never noticed it before. I'm gonna try and get it to show again, because for whatever reason, it let me checkpoint here earlier. Yeah, there you go. Random disk at the top of the screen. So yeah, that's when you get a checkpoint. I did not know that. Anyways, throwing dumpsters. Not a good idea. Apparently, just like in uh, Vampire the Masquerade, juggling dumpsters or outrunning the 815 is a bad idea. Alright then, I won't be uh, throwing crap. Hold on, did hobos pull guns on me? Is, is that what I just saw a little while ago? Because I'm beginning to think that I just saw some hobos pull guns on me when I threw a dumpster. You'd think that they would instead just run away because they were like, Dude, that guy just threw a dumpster! That's crazy! Whatever. A basketball? Do I get an achievement for, like, throwing this into a hoop or something? Oh. This is gonna be difficult, isn't it? Whoa, that was really high. For a second, I thought throwing the basketball caused someone to scream. <laughs> Alright, let's see here. Try there. Whoa! Where'd it go? That is a heck of a basketball. Really nice and bouncy. I like the basketball physics in this. Let's see here. Let's try to, uh, to aim a little bit lower. Right about there. Aw, oh, come on! No, I, I didn't want the dumpster. I wanted the ball. Ahem. I'm not going to try and throw the dumpster into the hoop. That would probably be a bad idea. Oh man. It feels like I need to go back further, but I can't. Because the ball is thrown so hard that it bounces off. Maybe if I do it from uh, from over here. 